Hey everyone, welcome back. <laughs> Do not leave this video and not get palace pens in your backpack. Put this case in there and be ready to go. It is an easy problem to solve when you always carry your pens and you don't have to rely on the pens that are there. It's just a simple fix. Come on, go get them. One of the key leadership functions that I've always done is created a agenda for our meetings at the time of the meeting. Now, because things are moving so fast in the technology industry, it's so different, I'll be schedule out a month for a team meeting. And everybody says, hey, what's on the agenda? What's on the agenda? By the time the agenda is formed and we get to the meeting, most of the people don't even want to talk about that because everything's moved on. So what I learned over the last several years is because the speed of innovation is so fast, I bring everybody together in the first hour and we build a backlog of topics that people want to talk about that day. All right? That's what a team meeting is all about. Now, if you're doing strategy work around a particular product launch and stuff like that, well, that's fine. But I'm talking about a team meeting where we're going to go on the whiteboard. And so what we do is I'll start off with topic list. Okay. And I say topics, come up here and I'll say, tell me what you want. And then we had no topic is off limits. As a leader, this is super important. Let's say you got 15 people in the room. You got your team members, you got various people, stuff like that. I said, what do you want to talk about? And I'll just stand there and I'll wait. And somebody will say, um, we've got a release coming up of software that uh, it looks like we're going to be delayed on. Okay, so I can put up here, I'm going to go software delay release. Okay, what else? And then someone will say, hey, I've got two open recs, okay, that I need to fill and they can't because HR standing in the way or whatever the problem is, whatever that, the reason is, they want to talk about that. The next one is um, some business unit is not, <laughs> is not, not in, uh, is not cooperative. Ooh, that's a juicy one, right? Okay, so you're starting to get people to start tell you what's going on. And pretty soon you get topic after topic after topic that shows up. Okay, so now you get this big list and it takes about somewhere between 20 to 25 minutes because what I'll start asking them, I said, drill down a little further and further about what is it specifically that they wanna talk about in that topic. And so what we end up doing is we end up with a list and most days it's somewhere between 15 to 20 things before people kind of ease out and they start recognizing that they have corresponding problems in the same area that they didn't know. So the team starts gelling, right? And then I ask this question. How do you guys want to attack this list? Let's prioritize. And they'll all go, uh, we want to take this one first. So I'll put a number one by it. Okay, great. What's the next one you want to go? And they go, well, we're blind on our software here, but this one here, but we can't go to the delay in software until we deal with this one. Sounds good. All right. And then they'll say, oh no, number three down here, number four. And I said, great. Let's just start there and we'll start knocking the rest as we go. And then what we'll do is we'll take this over to a new board. I usually have a place with two boards, new whiteboard, because I want to make sure that I keep this around the whole meeting. We're going to keep going back to it. Typically a flip chart will work or one of those flip charts where you tear off something, you stick it on the wall. This becomes the roadmap for the next day or two or however long your team meeting your get together is right and you really want to maximize that and what happens as a result of this is that they show up with real-time problems real issues right now that need to be dealt with right now very tactical in that nature but they also want to know a strategy over uh, narrative that's going to hold the team together and what you're doing as the leader the facilitator etc is putting on their problems up there not yours this is so important. You are not the one with the problem. You are the team leader who supports the people who are solving the problems. So don't put your shit on top of them. Let them come to you and let them put their stuff up there and then you iterate with them, which at the end of the day will solve your problem. Okay? All right, so this is super important so that when you get done, you start doing these checks right here. You start going, that's done, right? That's done, that's done, that's done. And by the time they start going through that, that first day, they just feel like they've gotten all this stuff out of them. 
And then if there's a second day, which I usually went a day and a half, maybe two days total, we were able to start really going deep on some of these topics and we ended up coming back to some. We ended up coming back to some. And we may add a few more, but always, this is the funny thing about it. I have yet to have a team meeting, and I've had so many of them this way, where that the team felt like they were able to hit every topic on the board and they had at least some answer that was satisfactory for them where they can go forward or not, but there was an answer. There was something for them to do and they knew what to do. And then what ended up happening was is everybody started taking pictures of the board because that gave them context to remember the next time they went. Super important, okay? Building an agile backlog during a leadership team meeting for that meeting works in every industry. Technology, healthcare, transportation, pharma, you name it, it doesn't matter. Bring your team in, put that up on the board, it works every time. All right, again, don't show up to a meeting without your pens that work the way that's necessary and that you're not dumping a bunch of crap into the environment at the same time. All right, bye.